everybody and welcome back to my channel and welcome to my very first pre-plan in my new print impressions weeks. Um, I've never used one of these planners before. This is very new. So this is very jumbled. Please bear with me. Um, I'm going to spend the next few weeks trying to get the hang of it. But um, anyways, the kit I will be using today is a two page mini kit from Libby and Co. And it's called Succulents. And here you just have your habit trackers, a couple of full boxes, some three heart checklists, a couple of Monday through Sunday, some scallop labels, appointment labels, some thin appointment labels, a bunch of um, icons and typography. And then here you have some washi, your to do and today headers, your check boxes, some more typography, your weekend banner, icons, and some full ombre heart checklists. And then here you have your date covers. Yeah, I'm going to do what I normally do, speed you guys up through laying down the bones of this because I don't know how it's going to go. But yeah, I'm going to plan out the week of May 25th through May 31st. You can see this is undated, so it doesn't really matter. We're going to go ahead, throw some music on and get started. Okay, so laying down the base of this kit was way easier than laying down the base of my EC. I did go in with some thin washi from my mom's shop um, just because this one little strip from the kit uh, wasn't quite big enough to cover the bottom. And also I liked how the yellow kind of broke up the green and the pink and I thought it just added a little bit of splash of color. I'm pretty happy with how this is looking. I have a feeling this is gonna go much faster than some of my other plan with me's. But yeah, so this is the base. I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you guys in and go through the day to day of this week's upcoming plans. So yeah. So starting off, the first thing that I did is I just put a May script up at the top and then I used a today header on Monday and the first thing I wanted to mark is that I'm going to deep clean my house and I'm just using an icon from GL Designs Group, a flag from the kit, and then this cleaning script is from the kit as well. Then I put down a half box to mark my filming and uploading, but that is going to change because the more I looked at it, the more I was like, ah, I'm not feeling it. So I'm just using a munchkin from Once More With Love. These scripts are from my mom's shop and that laptop is from the kit. Then I wanted to put a to-do because I like doing daily to-dos whenever I do pre-plans because when I'm pre-planning, I never know what's going to happen. So having daily to-dos is always great. Moving on to Tuesday, I'm just marking working out with a flag and then a script from the kit. That is going to change as well. Um, there's a lot of changing that goes on in this um, plan with me because I'm trying to get the hang of it. Then I'm going to mark that I have a training session on Tuesday and I'm just using a home workout Ava from Planning Like a Pro and that training script is from Planner Kate. I did mark that uh, Tuesday was gonna be payday but I forgot about the holiday so I needed to move that. That's gonna change as well. But I do have a bill due on this day and that icon is from GL Designs Group and that pay bill script is from Planner Kate. On Wednesday, this is how I'm gonna mark working out for the whole week. I'm just using a label from the kit. That workout bag is from GL Designs Group and the gym script is from my mom's shop. And then I'm gonna mark uploading my memory plan with me because that's when I upload that and that's a laptop from the Fox and Pip and the script is from my mom's shop. Jumping down to Thursday, I'm just marking working out the exact same way that I did on Wednesday with a label, an icon from GL Designs Group, and that gym script. Then I go back up to Tuesday so I can change how I want to mark working out. Again, I'm getting the hang of this, guys, so bear with me. Then I'm just basically going to mark the exact same thing on um, Friday with working out and then... Uh, I'm going I have laundry that has to be done so that's gonna be laundry day and that is a basket from planning like a pro and the laundry day script is for my mom's shop and then of course I'm gonna add my to-do list 
On Saturday, I am gonna use this half box and I'm going to pre-plan on this day, meaning I'm gonna pull my stickers that I'm gonna use for the week. So I'm just using um, that planner is from the kit and the paper clip is from the kit as well. Then jumping over to Sunday, I'm just gonna put that full box and then marking that we have church on Sunday as well. Then I'm gonna fill out my habit trackers and give a final overview. <laughs> there are several things that were changed about this, but in the end, I really enjoy it and I'm really excited to get used to this planner. Hope you guys like it. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.